Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sarah Star. Thank you so much for being here. So today's video is going to be Goodwill. I went to Goodwill today and I found some um, amazing things, I think. Um, some clothes, a couple like um, decor pieces and one um, item for like the kitchen and a Christmas item. So yes, let's go ahead and get into this haul. And I wanna quickly mention, if you're new to my channel, I would love if you would consider subscribing and hitting that gray notification bell so you'll then know when I upload uh, my next video, which I usually upload a video every single day. And then my returning family, I wanna say thank you once again so much for being here. So let's go ahead and get into this haul. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with this. All right, so it's been about, it's been too long since I've been to Goodwill. I think it's been like two weeks, so I think. So I was so glad to go back today. So um, I ended up finding this gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful, you guys know I love Christmas trees and I collect them and I just, I have a two story house so I like to put Christmas everywhere in my house, you know, at Christmas time. So, um, I have a lot of trees but I have space for it and I just love every room has a tree. It's really fun. So, um, alright, so let me go ahead and show you this gorgeous tree. I was so excited to find it. So, and it's one of my favorite types of trees. It's a flocked tree which is like, uh, even like, it's like like my favorite type of, of tree. Um, so, because it brings back my memories of childhood because we did have a flocked tree growing up um, at times and it just, I just, I just love it. So, all right, so here it is. I'm taking it out of the bag here. But um, it was so inexpensive, you guys. Okay, so let me go ahead and show you. And it needs to, you know, get some like, it needs some love. It's like been smushed a little bit. But you can see it's totally got bendable little arms and it's gonna be perfect. Oh, I love it. Okay, so I'm not gonna um, fluff it up too much right now because it is flocked snow, so it'll get all over everything if I do it here. But um, let me go ahead and show you the, the uh, base. is just as gorgeous. It's the burlap looking um, base. Now, isn't that beautiful? I'll go in closer so you can see. Um, you can see the height of it. It's pretty big, you guys, right? So I know it's totally smashed. It needs some like fluffing. But it was three dollars and forty. I don't want to start my candle on fire back there. Um, three dollars and forty nine cents is all I paid for it. So, pretty good deal. All right. So let me go ahead and show you that. So, um, like I said, I can't wait to decorate it and just like you know, I'll even put a tree topper on it. It's a good sized tree. I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up, but yeah, it is a good sized tree. Like this would be even cute by my front door outside. Like anywhere, anywhere. Like I just. I love trees. I love trees. Okay, let's go ahead and start with this bag. I do have two more bags to show you here. So, let's dive into this one. Okay, my daughter found this dress. It is so adorable, you guys. It is like kind of reminds me of like a 50s style pattern. It's so cute. The shape of the dress reminds me, like I said, like something from the 50s or maybe late 40s. Um, it's just so cute. It has like embroidered flowers all over it. And I love that like pinstripe look to it. Like it's almost like menswear look, you know, like pinstripe. It's so cute. And then, um, and it needs to be ironed and I'm going to wash it as well. But this is Rare Editions brand. I love Rare Editions. They make some really unique looking dresses. And this has um, a little tulle skirt underneath. So, I mean, how adorable is this? So, so cute and ladylike. I love that. Reminds me of like, they used to have tools, um, you know, the skirts had tool, you know, back earlier in the 50s. So yeah, um, anyways, this was only, it was a great deal, $3.99. So, happy to have found that. All right, then um, I did find these shorts for my um, daughter. These are super cute. These are Old Navy, um, super soft, you guys. They almost feel like uh, they're they're cotton, but they almost feel uh, almost like I can't explain it, but they don't feel like denim. They're like very soft and like super comfortable, and I mean they, they stretch a little bit. These are two dollars and ninety nine cents. I did notice though when I got home that um, it does have a little marker stain there, so I hope I can get that off. But other than that, you know, really pretty color too. Like this like seafoam green, so pretty. So 
got those. Then I found this skirt for my, I found a lot of kids clothes today, but I did get some stuff for myself. But look at how cute this denim skirt is. It's a super stretch denim skirt. It's by Cat and Jack. And um, I love the detailing. My daughter found this skirt. Look at how cute that detailing is on the side. So cute. And then this was only, and has the same detailing on this side. I've never seen a denim skirt with that kind of like, it's so cool. It looks totally, I don't know, it's like a zigzag design. It's really adorable. And it was only $2.99. So, yeah, I thought that was really great. And um, it has, I don't know, it has some writing on the inside. Something about, is it recyclable material? I don't know what this means. Um, something about this, I think, is recycled because it shows, like, recycled bottles in there. So I think something about this skirt has something with like upcycling. I'm not sure. So anyway, there's that for $2.99. All right, then um, I found this beautiful bear. It says, God bless America. He's so cute. He reminds me of a Boyd's bear. Do you guys remember the Boyd's bears back in like the 90s? He, and he was an ornament, but I think I'm going to clip off this part and use it like for my tiered tray. Because he's like, literally, he's so cute. He's sitting on a rocking chair or a rocking horse. And he's wave, waving a flag. And he's so pretty. and like, Not pretty, but adorable. And I just love the red, white, and blue about it. So, yeah, it says God bless America on both sides. And I just think he's so cute. And, again, that flag is so sharp. I love it. It looks so, everything is, like, so well designed on this. So, even the little, like, little things for his little feet are there on the horse. So, 49 cents is all I paid for it. 49 cents. So again, wouldn't it look so cute on my tear trade for, um, uh, I have a, a white tear tray that I got Target on the Target dollar spot and I paid $5 for it. It's like enameled white. And then um, I'm gonna put this like on there for like 4th of July um, and decorate the, that is a red, white, and blue tear tray for 4th of July. Okay, then um, I got this for my son. It's a little big, but I think he can grow into it. It's so adorable. I love, this color it's so pretty this is Ralph Lauren polo Ralph Lauren and this was only one dollar and ninety nine cents and I love the little um, polo guy right there in yellow and my son's eyes are so pretty they're like a green uh, they're like basically my color but his are even pretty I mean his eyes are way prettier than mine but his he's got he got his eye color from me so his eyes are like just like just beautiful like green so like I just like to get um, colors that like kind of pop make his eyes pop so this will be so cute on him so um, yeah um, so there's that now the next thing I picked up for my daughter was these adorable brand new with tags pink like um, lounge pants so cute she could wear them in the summer with like a tank top around um, going running errands or out to dinner it's just so cute you can dress these up or down these are so cute they have like elastics at the bottom these are brand new guys so I only paid $3.99 but these were from Macy's so this is epic threads this is the brand epic threads and um, they're originally $36 at Macy's so anyway that was pretty cool to see and they look so cute on her. She tried them on, they look so cute. All right, the next thing um, I picked up was, I accidentally bought this because um, they were getting ready to close and so I put everything up on the um, table, you know, and I meant to put this back and I just, I just, I forgot. So it's fine, it'll go for my daughter. It's so cute. Um, it's a Forever 21 skirt, Forever 21. And it's just a really cute denim skirt. And um, so, um, this was only $4.99, so got that <laughs> on accident, but she can st she still likes it. Then um, I did get this. I love this frame. I feel like I already have this frame. Like, I feel like I bought it at Goodwill before. Like, on, I mean, I, like, I think I might have two of these now, <laughs> but I love, I'm so attracted to this color. It's so beautiful, this like teal. It's gorgeous, like just gorgeous. And see how I like this, like these shades of like green and uh, our blue and and it has like this Victorian vibe to me because the colors and everything and like the, 
the very like the molding like the crown molding on the frame it's just so pretty now it doesn't have glass which I'm totally fine with because if I put like a motivational quote behind me see this one it's hard to kind of see because it's got glass on it so I think it's better if it doesn't have glass and this actually has a magnet I'm kind of bummed about the magnet on the back I don't need a magnet on the back but I don't care because this is like really gonna work really well for me I, you can do either uh, landscape or portrait and it was only 69 cents for it so I love it and this color is out of this world this is like my favorite color I would love to paint accent walls in my house in this color like seriously I would make me so happy to do that so all right then I picked up these swimsuit bottoms for one of my daughters the tag fell off but they were a dollar ninety nine so we have a swimming pool so it's really nice to have lots of um, swimming swimming wear options then I got this other jean skirt for my other daughter. This is so adorable. This is another nice stretchy one. And um, this is by SO, which is Kohl's. And um, do they say SO or is it SO? <laughs> like, is that the brand SO or SO? I don't know how they say it, but it was only $2.99. And I mean, this is great again for easy summer pieces, you know, like so adorable. I love this denim color this dark denim it's really pretty okay then I also got my daughter these pajama bottoms she loves pink right now this shade of pink so she wants a like like a lot of her clothing to be in this like really pretty pink so um, these look brand new and so she's gonna have these as pajama pants um, so I'll show you like how nice they are they're very soft cotton and these were only two dollars and ninety nine cents and these are by the brand Three Gun, which I don't even know which brand that is. It's T R, let's see, T H R E E G U N, all one word. I don't, never heard of that brand. So anyway, got her those, and these I don't know if I told you, but were two ninety nine. Okay, then I got myself a teddy bear. So, um, he was super cute. Um, he is selling on eBay. I, I got home and I looked. He's selling on eBay the exact same one for, I think, $10 plus $15 to ship him. I paid $0.99 cents for him, and he's just so adorable. Now, do I need a teddy bear? No, but, I mean, I do because they're so cute. <laughs> you know what I mean? And for $0.99, cents, I mean, he would be so cute if I dress him up for 4th of July, like put him in part of my decor. Um, you know, I, he has jointed. This is why I bought him. He has jointed like legs and everything so he's totally like you I hardly ever see jointed teddy bears his head doesn't move just his legs but I mean he is just too cute for words he could wave <laughs> he could do everything so um, anyways he's just I love it like I feel like this feels very vintage to me um, and I'm gonna throw him in the uh, washing machine and he'll be like really clean I throw all my I mean I always wash my stuffed animals even if you know I might risk ruining it Oh, it makes a noise when I, you can hear it makes a noise. I might risk ruining it by washing it, but that's my rule. Like if I bring anything with stuffed animals home, I have to wash it, you know? So um, this even has the original tag on it and it's from CAFCO, C-A-F-F-C-O International Highway 231 North or something like that, Montgomery, Alabama. Yeah, so he's pretty cute. I wonder if he had an outfit before, you know, how he, if he came with an outfit originally. So there's my little bear. <laughs> so the next thing I got was this beautiful Cynthia Rowley. Gorgeous, gorgeous red number for me. Like, can you imagine this with red lipstick on during like this holiday season? Oh my gosh, I'm so thrilled about this one. This is so, like, I love it. It's almost... It's almost like it's a little much. I get it. Like the bow is like a little bit like like loud. It's a loud bow on there, but I'm like, hey, <laughs> the more the merrier, you know. So look at how cute this is going to be on. I think it's going to be so cute. <laughs> I didn't try it on, but it's a really nice thin knit and it's very well made. I can tell this is a very high end quality. And I know Cynthia Rowley originally this would not have been cheap. This would have been. Oh, 60, I don't know. I don't, I know that she's not as, I don't think she's as like popular anymore. I hate to use that word. Maybe, I hate to use that word. Maybe she's, 
I don't know if she's still designing clothes anymore. I don't know, but probably I'm thinking. But anyway, I used to I used to love like watching her on like um like like I think she's been on reality shows and stuff like that. Cynthia Rowley like on um, Project Runway and that type of stuff. So um, anyway, she so there's a the little label Cynthia Rowley, and then the back has a really nice zipper. I mean, this is like quality, you guys. Like this is quality like details that like, you know, make this expensive. So again, it almost looks like nobody ever wore it. There's no peeling on it. It's like perfect condition, really. There's no, I don't think anybody wore this, come to think of it, because it's like so, it does have, it has no tears or like no strings, you know, um, no, what's the word? Snags, no peeling. I think it was brand new and just somebody just decided they didn't want to wear it. So. And it's three quarter inch sleeve, which is so flattering because you can then wear like a lot of jewelry and I just, I love. So this was only $5.99. So I'm excited about that. The last thing I'm so excited, it's almost like I saw this on a TV show the other day or something. I don't know. I feel like I've like maybe put out in the universe that I wanted this. I don't know. But I think I saw this on a TV show the other day. I'm not even joking. And I found it at Goodwill. You guys, like what? I, okay, if you guys know of like, is this, is this a rare piece? Like, is this like from the 70s or am I imagining it? Like, I love this. I love this geometric print on it. It's a gorgeous, it looks like a piece of art. It's gorgeous. And it is by, um, there's the inside, it's by Cordon, Cordon Blue, and it was only 69 cents. Because when they put a line through it, it means different things. But this one was charged. I have I looked at the receipt. It was sixty nine cents. But it's so pretty, you guys. Like look at how cute it is. And I love that the pattern is on both sides. So when I'm using it, it doesn't matter which side I'm using it. You can see both the pattern, you know, on each side. Really well made. I can tell, and I can't wait to use it. So I'm like so jazzed, guys. Like so jazzed. Like so, yay. So cheers, <laughs> cheers to my uh, finding of this. I'm serious, when I saw it, I was like, wait, that's weird. I feel like I just saw this on a TV show. Like, you know, like a one of those throwback TV shows. I don't know, but anyway, there's that. So that is it for what I did. Is that a crack, you guys? Oh no, is that a cracky? No, no, it has a crack, you guys. It's a little hairline like fracture right there, but it's a crack. And uh, I won't be using this as a mug, sadly, now that I see there's a crack because I have a fear of broken glass. So I will use this as maybe a planter, like for succulents or, you know, um, a vase or something. I won't, I won't, I will keep this for sure because it's beautiful, but there is definitely a little fracture and see when I so when I shop I always have my sunglasses on so uh, because they're prescription you guys so if you ever see me in a video and I have my sunglasses on I'm not trying to be incognito or <laughs> you know like just yeah I'm not trying to be incognito at all it's just so comfortable wearing them because I have lighter eyes too so um, wearing them um, just going in and out of the store it's just easier for me it's just more comfortable my, my sunglasses are like a part of me they feel so comfortable on and so that's why I shop with them on so I'm noticing though with, you know, um, wearing the, you know, and then the sunglasses, I'm like, I'm feeling like my, um, my vision is not as good <laughs> because I feel like my senses are like getting all like, I can't see quite well. So, um, yeah, I just have to pay more attention to that now from the future when I'm shopping for glass at Goodwill, just double check. I'll just double check. You know, there's no like fractures or something like that going on. Bummer on that. But again, I can reuse it for something else, for gardening, succulents, anything like that. So, yes. All right, you guys. So that does conclude what I bought at Goodwill today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I do appreciate you. I appreciate you all so, so very much. And um, I hope you all are doing amazing. And um, so with that being said, I will see you back here tomorrow with my next haul. Okay, friends? All right. So till next time, everybody. Take care, God bless, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.